are going to learn how to make a crocheted chain. To begin, you need a crochet hook. You can grab one on the cheap, or I bet you have a friend who has a few to spare. They're inexpensive. They just have a hook on the end and kind of a length to hold on to. You can hold a crochet hook, generally speaking, like a knife or like a pencil. And I hold it kind of somewhere in between because I don't like to follow rules. And to make a crochet chain, first you need to secure your yarn to the hook by making a slip knot. Slip knot's really easy. It's like making a simple knot, but instead of pulling the tail through, you kind of keep the tail in the loop for a sec, put your hook onto it, put it on your hook, tighten, the tail and the working end of the yarn and it gets nice and snug up against the hook. You want to make it a little loose actually so it moves really easily on there. Then we leave the tail dangling. We're not going to do anything with it and we're going to grab on to what? To the working end of the yarn and then all we're going to do is use the hook to pull loops from the working end of the yarn through the loop that's on the hook to make a chain. Wrap the yarn over the top of the hook Grab the yarn with the hook and pull it through the loop. See how I'm using my fingers on this hand to hold on to the slip knot and now on to this first chain right here. That's just so I can make it really easy to move the hook through the loop. Grab the yarn, pull it through the loop. I've made another chain. There will always be one loop of yarn on the hook. The yarn over from behind over the top of the hook, grab it with the hook, pull it through the loop. This is a crocheted chain. You just keep doing that over and over and over again. And we'll be doing this for 15 minutes on the day of our effort to break the Guinness Book of Records record of the greatest number of people simultaneously crocheting, and then all of the bits of chain that we make will be used by artist Jessica Glesby to make an awesome art installation. If you want to learn more about crocheting, YouTube is your friend, or look me up and ask me some questions, and I will help you out. See you on June 7th at 1 in the afternoon at Vancouver Mini Maker Fair to break the Guinness Book of Records record for the number of people simultaneously crocheting. Cheers.